Hi guys, I am Trish with Unique Me 303 Healing and Empowerment. This message is going to be for Pisces for November 2021. Let's see what messages they have in love, romance, finance, ascension messages, messages from spirit or higher self. The first card that you had come out is Pipestone or Catlinite. This is all about connection with your ancestors through meditation is what I'm hearing. So get out and connect in nature. Meditate by taking... Uh, walks in nature, uh, sitting down, closing your eyes and meditating, listen to, to guided meditations to connect with your ancestors will even help. But either way it goes, connection with your ancestors at this time. This is also something to do with um, getting guidance on how to set firm foundations, whether it be um, connections in your home, connections at work, um, setting firm foundations when it comes to employment or something of that sort yes they're saying but either way it goes uh something to do with setting firm foundations and then you have bloodstone this is about detoxifying the blood carrying around bloodstone at this time will help you but this is also for some reason it normally doesn't come out this way but i'm also hearing to sage your body your auric body so your energy body so somebody needs to do that for sure yes they're saying but this is the root heart and sacral chakra card some of you may even be going through some sort some sort of emotional purge. Usually I don't get that with the detoxifying card, but it makes sense. Rose Court is all about love, unconditional love. Some of you are coming into an energy where you're uh, learning to not judge people as much, maybe not even judge yourself as much. Um, getting into a place of that Christ consciousness where you have unconditional love for people, seeing the divine within people through, um, you know, the eyes of, of Source God, you know, um, showing you the truth of people the real beauty that's behind people things of that sort yes they're saying what other messages do you have for my pisces please love both of them the first card that you got with the starseed deck is i'm sorry this is about writing past wrongs making amends with people people making amends with you something of that sort you could feel defenseless hopelessness Things of that sort, but it's asking you to be open minded to somebody making amends with you or you being the person that needs to step out and make amends with somebody else. Yes, but it's all about writing past wrongs and being okay with it. Um, and then the next card that you got is the golden children. This is about rare gifts opening, unique abilities, things of that sort. Some of you are feeling like you are in a totally new like time warp or you've been warped to some other time or something because there's just so much newness that is happening in your spiritual life is what I'm feeling. But anyway, this is all also about connection with the inner child, being tender to yourself, being gentle, um, you know, um, somebody.